The Voyager spacecraft, launched in 1977, have been on an extraordinary journey through our solar system and beyond. And as they continue to travel farther from Earth, the question of what will happen to these two spacecraft once we lose communication with them becomes increasingly relevant. To better understand their fate, it is essential to explore the history of the Voyager missions, their current status, and what the future likely holds for them. The Voyager missions consist of two spacecraft, Voyager 1 and Voyager 2. Their original purpose was to study the outer planets of our solar system, including Jupiter, Saturn, Uranus, and Neptune. They provided us with detailed information about these planets and their moons, revealing previously unknown features and phenomena. After completing their primary missions, both spacecraft continued to explore the outer skirts of our solar system, eventually entering interstellar space. Both spacecraft are powered by radioisotope thermoelectric generators, or RTGs, which convert the heat generated by the decay of plutonium-238 into electricity. Over time, the amount of power generated by the RTGs decreases, and mission controllers have been gradually shutting down instruments to conserve energy. On Voyager 1, over half the instruments are no longer operative. The first instrument was turned off in 1998, when its scan platform was shut down after the completion of the Neptune encounter. Other instruments have been turned off, or placed in a low power mode since then, based on mission priorities and available power. As of now, only a few essential instruments are operational on both Voyager 1 and Voyager 2, primarily those related to measuring the properties of the interstellar medium, such as the magnetometer, low-energy charged particle detector, and plasma wave instrument. However, in spite of these energy-conserving measures, it is expected that sometime within this decade, they will no longer produce enough power to support the spacecraft systems. Once communication with the spacecraft is lost, they will no longer be able to transmit data or receive commands from Earth. This means that they will become silent observers, drifting through interstellar space on their current trajectories. The hardware itself will remain intact, and its physical structures should survive for millions of years, barring any collisions with other celestial objects, that is. In the absence of communication, the Voyager spacecraft will continue on their paths through the Milky Way galaxy. In time, their trajectories will carry them past other stars and celestial objects. It is estimated that in about 40,000 years, Voyager 1 will pass within 1.6 light years of the star Gliese 445, while Voyager 2 will pass within 4.3 light years of the star Ross 248 in about the same time frame. However, these encounters will be brief and unlikely to have a significant impact on their trajectories. As both man-made objects drift through interstellar space, they will be subject to the forces and conditions of the interstellar medium. This includes exposure to cosmic rays, interstellar dust, and the magnetic fields of the Milky Way. Over time, these forces will cause the spacecraft to experience changes in their velocities, trajectories, or physical structures. It is also possible that the spacecraft could encounter other celestial objects, such as comets or asteroids, which could cause damage or alter their paths. One of the most intriguing aspects of these missions is the inclusion of the Golden Record, a 12-inch gold-plated copper disc containing images, sounds, and messages from Earth, intended to represent humanity and our planet to any extraterrestrial civilizations that may one day encounter the spacecraft. The Golden Record serves as a time capsule, preserving a snapshot of human culture and knowledge from the late 20th century. It is impossible to predict if or when the Voyager spacecraft might be discovered by another advanced civilization, but the existence of the Golden Record ensures that a small piece of humanity will continue to travel through the cosmos, potentially for millions of years. The Voyager missions have had a profound impact on our understanding of the solar system and the nature of interstellar space, as we continue to explore the universe, both through robotic missions and eventually human spaceflight, the lessons learned from Voyager will inform our approach to future explorations. Their legacy will also serve as a reminder of the importance of curiosity, innovation and the pursuit of knowledge as we seek to unravel the mysteries of the universe and our place within it.
As we develop new technologies and embark on more ambitious endeavors, these missions will continue to serve as beacons of human achievement and the potential for discovery that lies beyond our planet. In the future, our understanding of the cosmos will undoubtedly expand as we probe deeper into this seemingly infinite darkness. New missions like the James Webb Space Telescope, the Europa Clipper and potential missions to the ice giants Uranus and Neptune will build upon the foundations laid by Voyager. Their fate is a testament to the human spirit of exploration and the desire to understand our place in the universe. Their journey, which began as a mission to study the outer planets, has taken them to the edge of our solar system and beyond. Even after we lose communication with Voyager, their legacy will live on. They will continue to drift through the vast expanse of space, carrying with them the story of humanity and our desire to explore the cosmos.